Welcome to the Cypher with KJ and Mal. Yep. This is episode 15. The Catherine Wilson story, man, is going down in a real way, man. It's about to be a dope, dope show. And uh, this show is sponsored by OG Cosprays, man. We got the uh, yeah. sucker repellent right now, man. Y'all go get that that new uh, that new flavor, man. You know, sucker repellent yeah. uh, tissue. You gotta yeah. a lot of suckers. You gotta spray them off. Right. You know what I'm saying? I can't smell sucker right now. Yeah, you gotta, yeah. You know, we sucker free over here. <laughs> man, we you know what I'm saying? saying? You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah. you know, OG Cosprays, and we gotta give a shout out to uh, Yas Milan down in uh, Lithium Springs, Georgia, man. That's right. Um, for sponsoring this show, also. And uh, right now, man, we about to kick it to my co-host, man. What's going on, man? What's up, Kate, man? man What's going back, on, bro? Yeah, man, another one. Yeah, man. Had to, we had to get this one, man. You know, we we had it scheduled before, but yeah, you know, but then COVID, COVID. yeah, that yeah, hit, yeah, 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 that, that put that, a pause on everything. everything I, man. I told him, I said, look, man, we got to get her on there, man. Yeah, because Fox was saying the same thing. Yeah, yeah. Get tissue back we got to get him. Yeah, we, yeah, we got to redo that. Yeah, we have to redo it, and we yeah. back at the, uh, the the original spot. We you are saying here at the really Bible Lounge in Smyrna, Tennessee, man. Yep. Cuts, man. Master Bob himself, man. We got to get I shout am. out to Antoine, really, man. Yeah. What's up, dog? Mm-hmm. Uh, we back at the original place, man. We had to take it back. And right now on this show, we have a lot of female, man. I've been oh. on uh, all my life. Yeah. <laughs> you might as well say, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I've been yeah. on all my life, right. man. And, uh, right. She got a great story. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And, yeah. uh, real and she's doing real big things. Oh, yeah. Thank you. And, yeah. And I'm so proud of her, you know, so with all the stuff going on and, right. and black women getting the bad rep from the <laughs> brothers and all that. And she out here standing strong. Yeah. Ten toes down. You For know sure. what I'm saying? So but I love that about her, man. Right. But right, right. Now, man. I'm about to bring up to the to the mic, man. Uh, she's a fitness guru, man. About to get a PhD, man, because I don't want to <laughs> yeah. spoil it for the people, man. Right. But she got it going on, man. Y'all give it up for Catherine Wilson. Guys. Yeah. Well, thank you. How you doing, man? I'm good. I'm good. 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 Yeah. Life's good. Yeah, life's good. I mean, how you been doing, girl? You know, out here grinding. You know, the best thing you can do when you're trying to change your life is lead by example. So yeah. that's that's what I'm all about, you know, transparency and lead by example. It ain't what you say, it's what you do. Right. Man, you're right about that, man. So when did it start? Because I, I ain't seen the minute I moved to the A. You know, we yeah. grew up with each other. You know, you've been a half time a dancer. Mm-hmm. Oh, you going to go that? <laughs> yeah, we, hey, yeah. Come on, we, we gotta, family. We got to bring it back. Yeah. We family, man. So we taking it back, you know. When did it, you know, start for you? Okay, like, so when you mean when did it, are you talking like when I like decided to change my life around? Yeah, but or? just you know when okay, like okay well, from you know I'm from West Side. Yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> right, you, you you see that? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Taylor area. I went to Pearl Cole High School. Mm-hmm. Um, just a typical uh, black female that actually knew of her daddy, but he wasn't never in the role. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He had the title, but he never had the role, mm. which is huge yeah. because that's what I wind up chasing. Mm. Okay. You know, I wanted that father figure just to someone right. to tell me they love me, I'm beautiful. So chasing that yeah. distracted me from doing what I needed to do. You mm. know, uh, finishing high school, going to my prom because the first man that came and told me I'm beautiful I just gravitated to that Mm. and uh, a lot of black women are not honest enough to say that you know we you know, it's all for the games that you say, oh, daddy and poppy, but yeah. trust me. Right. It's, uh, right. it's, uh, it's some you needed issues. That stru- you needed that structure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's that, yeah. you know, and so I wind up, the first guy that met that I met, and he said, oh, you know, you look good. I just gravitated to yeah. that. And I wind up becoming everything he wanted, not what I needed to be. Right, mm. right. So I dropped out of high school and started having babies right off the back, you right. know. I miss prom. I miss all the things that, you know, we talk about, you know. Right. Um, I didn't. And so uh, I was very young, and I found myself didn't get a college education, didn't even have a GED. Mm -hmm. And, like, six years later, I woke up and, like, I got three babies. I haven't did anything with my life. And at that moment, I think I realized that 
I needed to change. Yeah. Well, you all know change comes with some resistance. Mm -hmm. And he wanted a wife. And mm -hmm. I didn't even know who I was. Mm -hmm. So, you know, yeah. the hard part, you right. know, literally he waited till I went to work and he sent me a message and said, you don't live oh. here anymore. Wow. And uh, he sent me literally out on the street. Really? Like me and the three babies. Mm -hmm. And so I, uh, I got a U-Haul truck, put everything in the U-Haul truck, and I never looked back. Yeah. Mm. So that's what, that, that's what, that was your rock bottom when well, you, when... well, that was not the rock, rock bottom. bottom, but it was... It, it was, was a pivotal moment. moment. It was a pivotal moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. like, like most hard-headed women, mm -hmm. you know, we, we're still hard-headed, and yeah. so uh, I met someone else, and, you know, you know, you like what you like. You like thug boys. You like, yeah. you know. And mm. so I met that, and then um, I didn't take care of myself. Next thing I know, I was uh, remarried, and I had weighed at my heaviest of 250 pounds. And, uh, mm. yeah. you know. So I, I can't believe they're looking at you right now. Really? Right. 250. Yeah, because I, 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 you know, I look back there. I, I looked at the store. I was like, wow, man, she really did yeah. transform. Like, if, if there's any example of mm -hmm. changing your body and mm -hmm. changing your way of thinking, mm -hmm. she, she's she most did. definitely, yeah, yeah, you can't say you can't do it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So you said yeah. 250 was your heaviest. Mm -hmm. Now, the, the, mm -hmm. you got like that because you felt like food was your, that was your escape? Or I got like, like that because I didn't care. You didn't, yeah. You, just, you know, we, we, we forget about taking care of ourselves. We think in taking care of ourselves meaning just looking good. Right. But we don't realize that taking care of self evolves more in mentally and spiritually. Like it's okay, but you can't club every Friday, Saturday night. Right. You know? Yeah. You can't you get older, your body requires so much more than you just do the typical just getting by, you right. know. Yeah. I like fast food as much as everybody else, but let's just be honest, it's not good for us and eventually it will catch back up to us. Yeah. Yeah. But me trying to be everything for everybody else, I forgot about myself. Yourself. And yeah. then I just wind up, you know, yeah. two hundred and fifty pounds. Yeah. So you so all the double cheese and here we go. Oh, man. Because I said, I heard the story about the double cheese. Yeah, you know, yeah. It was at the convention. I said, she was talking about that double right. cheese for on the dollar menu. Yeah. I said, yeah, I done had many of these, many nights nice of them. Yeah. yeah. And and after the club. Yeah, <laughs> and it's, yeah, and the four cheese crystals, you know, fry some dough salt. It's real. <laughs> oh, see, you got the menu already. Right, right, so right, right. So you ain't right. playing around. Right, You know right. what I'm talking about? Yeah. <laughs> but so, it will catch up with it you. Will. Yeah. It will. So yeah. 250. Mm-hmm. God put you out mm -hmm. with three babies. Mm -hmm. Then what, like? And then, you know, I was stupid. I remarried again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, you know, because I still was chasing that far. See, I never took a break, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. I kept chasing something, yeah. but I never did take a break. Right. You know, yeah. I kept putting a Band-Aid over a gaping, a gaping wound. Yeah. So I met another guy straight from the hood. You know, I love that. Yeah. You know, I like it. But he, a part of being a man is not bringing your demons. And he hadn't mm -hmm. fixed his demons. Mm -hmm. Alcoholism, gambling, yeah. shooting dice. So he couldn't be... A leader because right. he didn't even have any leadership skills, you mm. know. And so I was going down that path, but I was smart enough to say, "Whoop, I can't," yeah. you know. Right, right. But the hard part about that is, I didn't want to admit to the world that I made a second mistake. Mm. So I held on yeah. a little bit longer than I should have. Yeah. Yeah. And by the time it was too late, I was subject to him cheating a lot, you know, not coming home, and, mm -hmm. you know, the alcohol abuse, and you could be a good person, but once you have an addiction, you you change it to somebody you thought you'll never be, right. so it just evolved into a whole person, and one day, I didn't realize that I had absorbed all his negative energy that I was taking showers in the dark, mm. I was just, I was just a walking shadow, mm. and so, again, I just, I walked away. Yeah. 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 You know, because I couldn't, I got three boys, and I couldn't yeah. tell them to be a good man if I was tolerating this behavior from Exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. You know? And you, I mean, you needed that man, too, to kind of show the boys, because, right. you know, the whole saying, you know, a woman can't teach them, you know, yes. how to be a yes. man. So and you, that's what I was holding on to, because right. I already messed up exactly. with their dad, and I was yeah. thinking, yeah. you know, if I can really make this work, I can turn it around, yeah. but, yeah, yeah. You They know. just got to be the person, you like saying, don't know yes. how to change. Right. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So... Mm -hmm. 
And then, you know, yeah. I, I decided to take a break, for real, real, yeah. six-year break. Right. I went back to school, and I got my GED, and the day I they told me I passed the test, I enrolled in University of Phoenix, and I got my associate. The day I graduated with my associate, the next day I rolled back in and mm-hmm. got my bachelor's. The day I graduated, I rolled back in and got my master's. And the day I graduated, I started my Ph.D., and I am six months away from getting my doctorate. That's what's up. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah man. Right. That's what's up. That's what's up. It ain't got to happen. I'm trying to tell you, folks. You just got to believe. <laughs> yeah. Nobody want to believe you no more. Right, 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 I'm right. I'm serious, man. We don't talk about that to me. Man, man, yeah, man. I'm saying, you got to no. believe. Yeah. All in between um, walking back and forth to work. So when I was doing that, I was at 250 pounds. Mm. And in the course of three to four years, I dropped 145 pounds. Now, how long was you homeless, though, like when you... when you? So that was a really dark time. So yeah. I would say I slept in the car with my boys for about two months. Okay. Because keep in mind, I was, you know, my mom and them told me. Yeah. You know better than this. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Going back to them and telling them I messed up killed me. Mm-hmm. So I decided I'd rather yeah. fix this on my own than right. come back and beg them to help me. You know, yeah. I just yeah. could not for some reason I just could not um take that. Yeah. You know. So I uh about two months okay. and I saved up. I worked three jobs. Yeah. And uh, my friends kept my kids and uh, yeah. stayed up enough to buy my first house. I, 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 seen, friends, that. Right I seen that on you when I was watching your, yeah. your seminar. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Hype me up, like. Yeah, yeah, me hype. You know, know. What I'm what was that? What, what was that at? Here in the city? So, um, it's called the Manifester, and they literally um, rented out the Opera Lane Hotel, and okay. I sold out for 1,500 people. Mm. Mm. That's great. You had people up there shouting, I am. Yeah. You know what? I don't like him. <laughs> <laughs> I be down. You like, this girl got these folks out here. Really yeah. You know what I'm saying? No. I mean, just doing that period, like, I was like, man, because, you know, For real. public speech. Thank you. That's tough. That's hard to it do. Is. Yeah. It is. You know, that's it hard is. to do. I've, I've heard a guy say, man, I was like, man, I, it's like dying in yeah. a sense. Because, yeah. you know, you got everybody focusing on you. But. And you so you were so confident. Yeah. You, I wasn't, though. You was throwing yeah. the hand. Yeah, well, I wasn't. Yeah. But, you know, you it, you know, I was talking about manifestation. Right, right. And so it was important that I make people believe in. Sometimes when you speak the truth, your authenticity comes through. So mm-hmm. I just kind of zoned out and I was like. Stick it in existence. Yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> right. You did that. So you say he was homeless, so you say you got the house. Mm-hmm. So after that, it just went. Yeah. After I got the house, you know, I did what I, you know, what we, you know, so oftentimes we are, we go back to where we uh we know it brings us comfort. Mm-hmm. You know, I need a new man. Let's go back to the club. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you do yeah, yeah. for dog. So, <laughs> yeah. but, Shout out to the elves. You know, you you ooh, really you know. Yeah. <laughs> I said the elves, man. That's my spot. You bring your own shit. What? Like that, man. Let me get like, back out. Your damn. <laughs> so you pay yourself dollars. Yeah. You come through that door. You don't know what you finna right. get. So you know, I went there. You know, it's 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 the elves. Else, you know, yeah, right. you never right. know what you're gonna come out there with. Right. And I came out with <laughs> so what I came out with. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you feel like, I mean, like you said, you didn't have your, um, you didn't have your father. You feel like a lot of women struggle with that, like, pick, as far as picking a man. Yeah, yeah. They, yeah. They, they are looking, I know it may sound crazy and weird, it's like they are looking for that father figure yeah. type guy to, you know, it, not only, to, you know, to protect them, right. tell them that they're beautiful, and right. tell them you can do anything you can. You was right. That's what you were searching for, right? Well, you know how you guys say all the time, I hear men say it all the time, yeah. I never used to listen to it, and say says they... You know, ah, these females, you can't, you cannot, these females can't raise a dude. You can't t- yeah. make these, you know, you can't raise a, a female cannot raise a child, right. a man child. Right. Yeah. And you, it's the same way, you right. know. Even though, you know, mom, you know, a single parent do a good job and right. take care of you, that void is still there. It you is. You know that you had a dad. You right. know, your dad is supposed to be the first person that tells you you're beautiful. Right. Your, your dad is your protector, you yep. know. Your dad is the person that puts you on game. And when that void is not there, mm-hmm. yeah, it's wide just, open. 
it's yeah. wide open. Right. It's, but you still got that, you know, piece that you want to find. Mm. And so when that person, that original person is not there, you try to seek other sources, mm. you know. Mm. And that's why women today, you know, are so cocky and, and, and yeah. don't know their role because, you know, it's been blurred so much to the point they think I could do both parts yeah. and who's going to check me. And they me? can't. And yeah. they can't. Yeah. Right. And so they make 15,000 mistakes you know, in the midst of them in, trying in, to do that, in the midst of yeah. them trying to do it, because you know, let's just be honest. Right. I mean, you know, there's man, there's woman. Right. That's just it. You know, right. I love. You know, there's no greater love than black love. But you got to understand that it's a union. It's mm-hmm. equally yoked. You exactly. Know? Right. And one person, we are natures. We're comforters. You know, we ain't supposed to know how to do all that. You exactly. know, I'm good because I have to be. Yeah. But the role was forced upon me. But make no mistake. You know, when you got two. Two separate components and bind right. together. It's amazing, you yeah. know. And so mm-hmm. I think women today have gre- have strayed away from it. It's no, it's not cute right. to be dominant. Right. Because my sister got sure, three. Right. She got three. She got three boys. I'm single in the mall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm tired of talking, motherfucker. Right. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You know, like my, my sister got three boys. That's why I feel like you know, you know, they you know they fathers you know incarcerated. They know who their father is, but I feel like I, I, me, it's a responsibility. That's my yeah. nephews, yeah. Yeah. so they need to see right. that male. But role they have to even your yeah. role now. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, yeah. You know, me and that don't want to be uncles. Yeah. Yeah. That crazy? I mean, if I have yeah. a flat tire right oh, now, yeah. I'm not gonna even tell you. It's yeah. like it's bad. It's bad. Yeah. You know? yeah. And it's like that's the stuff we grew up on. Right. Good uncles. Right. You know, right. Good nephews yeah. and yeah. that stuff. But now everybody out here trying to be popular. Right. And nobody wants to create a legacy. Yeah. You know, and it's it's sad yeah. because you really can't get mad at the new generation because we didn't give them the game. Mm-hmm. You know? Church yeah. on the move on that. Like that. <laughs> Church on the move. Yeah, because That's you ain't lying because we've been, me yeah. and Mal, me and yeah. Scott the same family, we, we trying to put the bond together as yeah. far as like, hey, yeah. man, you do this, you do this, we come together as a nucleus. Right. right. But see the bigger picture, we can mm-hmm. win. Right. Mm-hmm. Everybody want it. Man, no, yeah. nigga, I want 50000 a day. Yeah. Right. Like, right. I got 50000 yeah. right. You know what I'm saying? We just believe in the shot. Well, you know I mean, you know, good coffee, it takes time for good coffee. I say right now, we are in the instant. Yes. Stage. Roll. And <laughs> been instant for so long. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, it's, it's the microwave life. Yeah. 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 You know what I'm saying? Well, but, you know, it, it, it only takes one person. Right. Yeah. yeah. And that's the thing. Nobody wants to be that person. Mm-hmm. You know, like females today, they want a bad body. They don't want to work. Mm. They want to drink teas. They want to put these waist trainers on. <laughs> so like that stuff still ain't underneath that. I'm so sick of that diarrhea tea. They get some of that I'm shit so everywhere. I'm so sick of it. And I'm so yeah, sick yeah, of these, put the these put women the that feel like they yeah. got on bulletproof vests. I don't know if we about to go out or go to yeah. work. I don't really know what's going right. on. <laughs> it's too much. You know? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you know when you, you, you know you hug, you hug a lady, that be hard. I be like, damn, what's all that? Like, what is? I, be, I, I ain't gonna lie, I thought it was a bulletproof vest. I said, what are you into? You get behind them, yeah. you get out, slide them out. Yeah, 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 like, oh, oh my, oh, God. Chris, you know, Christy love, right? You're like, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and that's because, again, yeah. we've let society tell us what we know in our hearts. Yeah. Right? You see what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. We yeah. chasing, like, even my my brothers, I tell them, you guys posting these Instagram models sends a message to regular women. Sure. Do your role. Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. Do your role. Right. Broadcast your sister in her natural state. Okay. You know, celebrate yeah. that. It's not okay. When you you when you sit up, trust and believe, we still love you guys. Yeah. We just want you to step up in that role and show you can be true leaders. Yeah. We watch everything you say. Right. You know, so when you posting Becky or you posting all these women that's been put together, right. you know, under the knife, it, it tells us we're not good enough. Mm, you know, okay. it ain't what you say, it's what you do. Right. So if you out there glamorizing these women and we're looking at like, dang, we love y'all, but this is what you want, then it makes us change. We right. start yeah. to try to doubt. And then you don't get yeah. the true queen that you grew up on. Mm. You get this fast food. Man, yeah, yeah, fast food. Yeah, the fast food. Because I was telling my I said, I love a good roll. If yeah. you got a roll and stretch mom, you, you ain't been through nothing. You ain't been through nothing. You ain't been through nothing. You know, say like you said, I'm in the night being yeah, good. Yeah, no, no, yeah, no, yeah. that's the same way. You know, I know you brothers can't keep your hair up. 
for the rest of y'all life. Yeah. I'm okay with you <laughs> know what you need to do. Yeah, it's over for yeah. me. <laughs> yeah, it's over. So, so George Mine Jefferson. just left me. I, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna yeah, lie. Yeah, yeah, I ain't give George Jefferson. You know, I, hey, but a lot of women like the baldy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Bald, Sometimes, yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? High school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just broke. Yeah. Yeah. You know. <laughs> <laughs> but it's the truth. Exactly. Man, yeah, but right. Like you said, man, women going cutting under the knife and yeah. everything and it's the natural too- beauty. It's, 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 it's too much. It's too much. And then, you know, then then they wake up, they don't even know who they are themselves. Yeah. Mm. So how are they going to be a real woman to you if they don't know who they are themselves? Right. They full of plastic imperfections inside mm-hmm. of them. They can't identify with right. it, you know? But, but a lot of women argue off head, oh, no, it's my bad. I want to do what, you know. Yeah. And that's true. But then you seeking, but you still seeking social media validation. Right. Mm-hmm. You know, you on, you Say worrying that. about likes and comments, then yep. making sure that your dude is good. I, I say it all the time. That's yeah. what people are living for. That's yeah. it. Like uh, they want hearts. People will wake yeah. up in the morning and if they ain't popping, they feel like their life is over. You know, you can't get into the gates with comments and likes. Look, comments and likes don't get you nothing in real exactly. life. Exactly. Exactly. But people have have separated themselves to what they they identify based on people's opinion. Nobody's right. willing to walk alone. Right. That's yeah. crazy. That's yeah. crazy. You yeah. was born alone. Exactly. Yeah. You know. Exactly. People scared yeah. to be alone. That's what we talking yeah. about the COVID. Uh, Right. COVID 19. They was like, man, you straight up some man. I've been COVID 19. Right. I've been social distancing. All my life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Sure. exactly. But you know what I'm saying? It, no wrong it most definitely drove people insane. Yeah, man. I got to go out. What do you got to do? It did. Be over there the regular club. club. You know? Hold that drink. Right. Yeah, right. Well, you know, they is kicking it downtown Nashville. I saw it. Yeah. It is, it's off the chain. But that's because people had, they're scared of their demons. And that's what I had to learn. Because mm. that's why I kept making my mistakes. Because I never addressed my demons. You never addressed them. Demons of depression. Demon of feeling like I'm not good enough is let somebody validate me. Right. Now you can't tell me nothing. Right. right. I know what my work speaks for itself, so I don't even have to talk a lot. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. because I face my demons. Yeah. And people don't. We just go out there and think, let me get this dude, he'll make everything right. Let me get this girl, mm-hmm. she'll make everything Hell right. No. But you yeah. got to come at a unit. We all got baggage. Right. But baby, bring something to the table. Hey, yeah. Man, you know? Yeah, yeah. Man, I'm tired of being a sky cam. You what? Tired to be a what? Sky cam. What? Please. What? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Everybody got baggage. I ain't saying I'm just. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, you're yeah. tired of being a. Yeah. A sky cam. That's why I'm chilling. Yeah, yeah, we chilling. Chilling is a good thing. Yeah, you know, saying just you know get your stuff in order, like you said. You sometimes. I mean, you gotta, yeah, you gotta face. Like she said, you gotta face up. Yeah, people are scared to face. And don't you just get tired of dealing with the same old group? Yeah, man. You know, and then like you say, you face. You know what I'm saying? Then you say you by yourself facing them demons, right? And you can't face them by yourself. But then you you guys both at home fighting demons. That's not gonna work. Sure, man. You know, have a crazy ass house. If anything, full of demons. Yeah, I met a few demons. I think that's why I saved right. <laughs> Get out of here, Satan! Yeah, yeah. In yeah. the name of Jesus, right. hallelujah! Right. All that. But um, you said, man, um, right? You, you with the kids, and yeah, yeah. You got your house. You're rolling. Mm. So you about to go? You about to go hard in this fitness? Because I'm, I was looking at you like, okay. I want to say yeah. two years ago. Okay. Yeah. Man, you had me tired looking at you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cause the way you was, you was like doing some sit ups. Uh-huh. A nigga threw a medicine ball, uh-huh. threw it, in, uh-huh. threw it, in, uh-huh. then a nigga threw a refrigerator. <laughs> then you <laughs> <twisted> <laughs> him up. A refrigerator. <laughs> but the way you was moving, right. man, the strength that you yeah. just like. That's like I played ball. You just got to get into it. You know, right. you go sweat. Right. Like some of these people go to the gym. Right. Y'all too cute to sweat. Because they playing games with themselves. You know, we all got a, a superhuman strength. Mm-hmm. We all, make no mistake, whether it's intellectual or it's physical strength, we all got a strength. The problem is we don't want to use it, mm-hmm. you know? Yeah. We don't want to use it. We don't want to tap into that energy because we're scared of what people are going to think or we're scared to let, let our guard down. Listen, listen, I went hard for 10 years. Mm. for people who didn't care about me. So I decided, why can't I take that same energy right. and get to I would love a dude until I couldn't even love myself. Why can't I do that for myself? Right. And when I did, I started working out more, you know? 
I, can, I will stay off all night. Is you coming home? Is you coming home? Why can't you do that for yourself? Why can't you love yeah. yourself mm. relentless enough well, yeah. to put that same energy in yourself? And trust me, you get a better outcome than you do when you put it out there. It's part of the problem is I think people have gotten away from identifying on what they really can do. Yeah. And they just want people to hand it to them. We living in a generation where if you don't hand it to me, yeah, I'm not going to work they don't want to do it. They don't want to put the work in. Yeah. Hell no. Like, I, you know, I tell I speak about self-preservation because mm-hmm. you was talking about that at your um, at your seminar. Mm-hmm. I mean, you self-preservation, you you have to kind of be selfish, yeah. right? To, for yeah, yourself. Yeah, and, and it's not yeah. on the selfish, yeah. on no, like, yeah. evil and vindictive stuff. But right. if you ain't right, you can't be right for nobody yeah. else. But right. the thing about it is, how can, I can't take care of a weed exactly. if I ain't took care of me. Exactly. You know, I, yeah. I had nothing. I had a, not a GED. I was out there. I couldn't bring nothing to the table, you know, other than what females... Don't fuck. Yeah. Yeah. That's not enough. <laughs> That's not enough, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I'm asking for a king. Right. But I'm bringing nothing in. I got a bag Man. with a hole in it. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So I needed to take a time out and take care of myself. Exactly. And say, hey, uh... I got three degrees, got a PhD, the? I got an online business, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. What, okay. you, what, right. you, what you what you what you wanna do? Yeah. You know? You like Jay Z, I got yeah. my swagger back. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Right, right. Because right. when people I've known this when people think you're worth it, yeah, they will give you what you deserve. Right. You know? Right. But if you just come in a package and it's empty inside, yeah. You're going to get number yeah. topical. Mm-hmm. So, you know, it's, it's, it's important. It's not going to kill. We, we all done experienced relationships. We all done had sex before, so <laughs> you can go without it. Yeah. Until you get yourself together. Right. You know? Right. Yeah, a lot of people can't do that, baby. That's it. And then they wonder mm-hmm. why they 60 years old done went through the whole West Side Nashville. Mm-hmm. And, you know, and nobody wants that. And by they sell. How, yeah. how many times you see people go on Facebook? Oh, yeah, man. Right. And right. you be like, darn. And they still right. over there acting damn fool. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> they over there acting goddamn fool. And females is Tony important. Arnell. You know, you just can't. You got to have a legacy about yourself. We all got a history. Yeah. But my goodness, you know, you don't need to collect a resume based on Past relationships. Right. Yeah, and then I'm looking at it, you know, leave a legacy, you know. Yeah. Like we getting older, you yeah. know, the people we went to school with is dying off. You know, from cancer, getting killed mm-hmm, or, mm-hmm. or something. Right. Just, mm-hmm. You know, you just live and, and die. Right. You know what yeah. I'm saying? But nothing left. And nothing behind. left. You yeah. know, everybody wear a t shirt and but that's it. No, I need to get this doctorate so you know I can have a foundation started up, my kids can know a legacy, I can I can really help make an impact, you know. I do TED talks, that stuff is out there forever, you yeah. know. Yeah, and well. it is is more than just having your name RIP on T shirt and everybody meet up at the club and talk about a few good times. It's, yeah. That's not enough. That's not enough. Yeah, and all and all you got is memories and a, and a cold it. and a cold bill. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> you know where we from, girl? I know. <laughs> right there. <laughs> and, and then the thing yeah. about it, we like you said, we went from my west to mm-hmm. Rice Creek, and mm-hmm. like, oh man, y'all got grass over here. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? All that good shit. Well, you know, I really wasn't for Rice Creek. Uh, you yeah. you, you I was a fire burn. There you go. <laughs> but you know, even you, you rap. Yeah. You have no kids. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I'm okay, it's, it's just a standard that I have. It's like yeah. my mom just told me when but, I was 10 years old. She said, uh, if you haven't, you know, if you have sex with a woman, mm-hmm. you know, uh, you know, niggas love running raw dog. And, right, right, know. right. And I'm like, can you be with this woman for uh-huh. the rest of your life? Uh-huh. You gotta look at these things. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. So it's like, but you don't, but you have nah, a standard. I mean, yeah, because <laughs> <laughs> and plus I didn't have I, yeah. I, I didn't have my father. Right. So it's like I'm not gonna be out here. Right. With Thank son, you. And, Thank so you. I just be cool. With right. Yeah. People, you know, I, it, you know, women used to laugh. Oh, something wrong with you? Ain't nothing wrong with me, baby. Yeah. <laughs> the whole thing is, it's all about morals and standards. This is yeah. what I roll by. That's it. Right. And that's it. And, 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 and it saved me a whole lot of money. That's exactly what we're getting away from. Nobody has no standards. Yeah. Yeah. Me a whole lot. I know niggas crying over man that child support got and wiping his mouth. I'm sick of it, baby. <laughs> I don't want to live like this. Right, 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 right. Like right. I said, I lost one. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But at the same time, it's like, you know, yeah. okay, they gave me, like you said, more power to be better. Like, okay, I right. lost a baby, man. Let me yeah. That you don't want to be that guy. Yeah, I don't Wiping your mouth talking about, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. yeah. No, See, the responsibility right. is not in the act. 
yeah. responsibility is in the legacy you create in that. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So you did, you set standards that a lot of men don't look at anymore. Mm-hmm. You yeah. know? They just think it's good to get their name out there. No, it's well, not. I mean, damn, I have them scattered. I know we got scattered sites, but I want to scatter sites everywhere. You know what? Stop. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But when you, uh, did you, you know, you know, you, you strong as hell. Did you ever do like, like fitness competitions? Or? No. Nothing, mm-hmm. just just a, a lifestyle. I just turned that anger and that inability to fight into my own self. I just, right. I'm I'm not the best, but I'm the most determined. Right, and I, and and, and why you saying that? I, at your seminar again, you said you ran with some guys. Yeah, every yeah. morning I ran with and some good, some good, yeah. And and, and, you, and you knew, behind. and you said you said in your video, you said you <laughs> knew you weren't gonna be able to catch them, mm-hmm. but you. Just seeing them hit that corner, mm-hmm. you said mm-hmm. that was, that was just your focus point, mm-hmm. just to be mm-hmm. keeping up with them, right? This like, is the way I do now. Yeah. I have no room for new friends. Everybody around me has a place in my life. Mm. I'm just being honest. I don't have no cheerleaders. Everybody in my life right now that I deal with is for a reason. Is for a reason. Yeah. yeah. You know whether they motivate me physically or motivate me mentally. Right. I I study with a group of uh, third year PhD students that working on their second PhD. Okay. Because they push me. You right. know, this right. ain't new to them. Yeah. You know, they yeah. true to this. But it brings another beast out of me. Right. I run with a group of guys. Yeah. Six miles. They've been in the military all their life. Right. I will never catch them. They call me Turtle. Okay. That's what they call <laughs> me. Yeah. Yeah. They try yeah. a walk yeah. to me so that I can keep up with them. Yeah. And they yeah. Yeah. Me. But they make me a beast yeah. in my own oh, playing field. Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. Right. That went over there. Yeah. She has lost so much weight. I chase her because she's steadily losing weight. Okay. She gives me the motivation that even when I say I'm good enough. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Right. She, I, her drive makes me want more right. and more, which right. overall makes me a better individual. Right. So nobody, I had, I two years ago, I cut out everybody. Okay. If you wasn't adding value to my life, spiritually or mentally, I cut you. Message. Mm-hmm. Message. Mm-hmm. You know, Cause like you said, you know what they what they all say, birds of a feather. They fly together. together. You know what I'm saying? You know, yeah. and you know. sparrows travel alone. You gotta stop messing with these pigeons. You know, yeah. people only yeah. look. Dog don't bark at moving cars. Dog bark. They don't bark at standing cars. They bark at moving, moving cars. cars. Right. So yeah. don't worry about the hating. They right. supposed to hate on you. Yeah. That when you know you're going in the right direction. So you no. know, I think right now people need to stay more on what's in front of them right. and not so much what's going around them. Right. Because mm-hmm. when you stay focused on what's in front of you, you can care less what's going on around you. Exactly. Say, yeah. you say that. Say that. Man, man give it up for that, man. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, yeah, I like haters. <laughs> I love yeah, you know. Let them know I'm doing something. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I just let them know I'm doing something right. Yeah, I'm doing something right. You know what I'm saying? Don't hate on me. I don't like it. Like, must be doing something. I mean, you guys are doing what y'all need to do. You get yeah. a, a voice out there. Yeah. Yeah. You, but you got mad people that sitting on the sidelines talking, and they're mm-hmm. not contributing to nothing. 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 They're right. not doing anything. Got a whole but lot they got more talking yeah. to say what y'all not doing. Right. You know? Know what you need to do, baby, is is is, is get a get a falcon in there. Yeah. I'm not falcon. <laughs> get a falcon. I'm a falcon. It's Just a, think about it. That's gonna terrible. be a bro- that's gonna yeah. be a lady that's messed up. And she's going to tap into y'all podcast one day. Mm -hmm. And you guys have changed her life for the better because now she has not just a social media person to look at or Instagram model or a rapper. She's got a tangible black female that she can look at. It's like, dang, this lady was homeless. Yeah, man. You know? Because I seen that happen. You know. But I want to ask one question, you know, before you matter. Right, go ahead. When you say you in the transformation, Mm -hmm. what was the diet? You know what I'm saying? Was it, was it low carbs? Yeah. I ain't got no more money for to be doing all that. That's why I'm about to ask. Because, you know, folks, I can't you know. do vegan. I can't do. Look here, my mom and them come from West Nashville. Okay, okay. I cannot. Yeah. The basic boy food groups, let me just tell you this. If you can eat it, bake, bake it. Take that white, change it to wheat, you know? Right. Do what you can. Cut out them drinks. Go to water. Yeah. I just did basic, simple stuff because it works. If you make your diet too complicated, your body is going to miss it, mm. and it might not be the next day, but two months from now, you're going to pull up and risk it all because I'm, your body needs it. Because I don't understand yeah. all these folks, man. I'm like, man, can't yeah. just bake it and steam and yeah. right. roast your well, vegetables. Well, we know you and know and how to cook. Oh, yeah. yeah. My man can get, I tell Kay. He I gets said, down. He do. Yeah. He gets down. 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 He gets down
really do. Damn. I tell him, man, you know what I'm saying? I said, okay, you, you shouldn't have no issue pulling a lady. Because I should have been, you know what I'm saying? I should have been in the kitchen. A, he made me look at my kick. I'd be like, like damn. Damn. I tell him, he motivate me all the time. You, you know what I'm saying? saying? This a man, right? He motivate me. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, for real, like, man, how you do this right here? Yeah, right. It's just a little yeah. season or whatever, but, you know, like, a lot <laughs> of people. A little season is, you out there fricking <laughs> sin and AM sin oh, and everything. Man, no, K- 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 can get that. Uh, shout out to all my couple of big Steve. We were like, <laughs> <laughs> all. But at the same time, you know, we got these folks, you know, they go to the gym just like you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess I, I'm, I'm going to say, man, sometimes I look at it, some people do it for sure, you know. It is. It's like, y'all got a. Y'all got that ponytail down and you're touching your hair like that. Full face makeup. Yeah. I know. And I then, know. And then right. you go to the high, the highest damn place yeah, yeah. in the world to get one little juice. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. say, I, I, who, the, the workout. And then y'all doing the boomerang. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you know, yeah. Never, people, people think it's about the domain. They always gratify, <laughs> gravitate to stuff that they think, this. if I get with this group or this thing, this going to make me pop. It's never about your domain. Mm-hmm. It's must inside of you. It's inside See, of you. I work out outside. And ain't nobody on my level playing field body kicking like mine. And I work outside. Yeah. Mm. $10 Planet Fitness. It's never about where you at. It's where you go. Mm. Yeah. You know? Mm-hmm. And people lose sight on that, you know? And then, like I said, the pressure to look a certain way. You know, this big butt and big chest is overrated. Yeah. What are y'all doing? And they can't wash clothes. They can't separate clothes. <laughs> they can't separate. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know well, what? I mean, I'm not into the I'm not into the fakeness. You know what I'm saying? I'm not. I mean, I, 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 I do like a natural natural female. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If she got stretch marks, like, that's cool. I love you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, it's just, she been somewhere. Yeah, it's all she natural. Like, right. I've touched a fake ass before and it's, it don't feel right. It don't. It's, it's just like, like a I'm like, <laughs> like what? Okay. I mean, it's hard. It's hard. It's hard. <laughs> it is. <laughs> I just don't, I mean, I just don't like it. You know what I mean? I, that's just me. You know? Like so I'd rather have, you know, nat- natural. You, yeah, know it, 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 you gotta be, oh, at the end of the day, you have to be okay with yourself. Mm. I'm not, I I think it's great when you want to change yourself or make yeah. yourself look better. A new version of you is great. But you, at some point in your life, you yeah. have to be happy with yourself. Right. Mm. And that that's what we're getting away from. You know, I, I, I can't tell you how females now are changing so much to the point, you know, you don't even respect how you look. Why mm. you don't want, you know, how you think you're going to get it back in return? Right. You know, dark skin and light skin used to be oh, a thing. Yeah. I know it's I'm still just, going down. It's, still, it's yeah. crazy. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. crazy. It's sad. It's, crazy. It, it's sad, though. You know, it's really sad. It is. You know, it, I mean, I, I, I never. I, 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 I don't know how to break it. I, I, it's it's Tish. Black men, it's hard out here for us. Me and, me and Mal talk about all this. I mean, okay. I've dedicated my life to finding the darkest guy I can find in my life. Mm-hmm. Because yeah. that's it's Where you from? Huh? Tell the home. Mm-hmm. Nah. nah. <laughs> 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 you know some dark niggas down in uh, I, I think I go yeah. deeper. I like yeah. Mississippi. Miss, okay. Oh, it's run through my blood. Okay, mm-hmm. you got to taste that. <laughs> what you know about King <laughs> Cotton? <laughs> but I think you got to... I think people... Need to start being. Don't worry about what society putting on right, you. Right. Put on what you want. I like you. You like what you like, and you need to embrace it. But yeah. nobody should be in superior than each other based on some skin tone. Yeah, it's yeah. crazy. It's ridiculous. Yeah, you yeah. Know? yeah. I yeah. know you see it all the time doing your fitness and everything. You're like, oh, she dog, she built, she ain't. Yeah, and you got the lights in. Oh, she cute. Mm-hmm. You know, it, it's terrible. And then you yeah. get them, and they're a whole nut. You take them home, and they crazy. Yeah, you know, you got to start. You know, we got all these legacy people, and we don't even listen to them. Martin Luther King said it over and over again. Judge people by the content of their character. character. Yeah, the if yeah. I did that back yeah. in the day, 10 right. years ago, yeah. where would I have been? Yeah. I would have, you know, we are, let me tell you something. We didn't get, people make mistakes, but you miss the red flags. Mm-hmm. That's the problem yeah. these days. We see the, we want to see the best in people, and they right. not even live it up. I fell in love with people because that's what I thought they were, yeah. not what they revealed right. to me. Right. Right. So you yeah. a whole yeah. person out here making mistakes over and over again. But in my eyes, I need a man. Exactly. I need a man. I need a man. And if I can make this work, but I was never judging him on what he was, right. what he was showing me. Right. You know? Yeah. And so I think people need to, especially female, if it's a red flag, quit playing around with it. Yeah. You know? There's nothing wrong with being selfish when it comes to choosing your mate. No. You need to be oh, selfish. Of course you not. Be selfish. Man. Because my whole thing, my mama always told me, baby, 
get a woman when you get sick, but she's still gonna be there. Right. That's you know what I'm saying? Right. It's true. You know, we get know the nigga. Yeah. I'm about to be 43 yeah. this year. Yeah. You about to be 43? Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I ain't saying I'm sick or nothing. But you're like, <laughs> you know, so a lot of people. <laughs> yeah. A lot of you know, I done heard some stories. Right. 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 You know, well, that you money know, run out. And you they know don't. where we from? The no boy style. Everybody's fun. Like you can send me to the mall, buy my sh- shoes, my Jordans and stuff. Yeah. But when he catch that case, what happens? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> yeah, man. They ain't got nothing to say. And they said know, it was all good just a week ago. Yeah. You know what and I mean? that's what I said. Men date women that look good, but they don't even look at their substance. Yeah, right. You know? Mm. You can't yeah. get real mad when she, when yeah. you know, you, you yeah. looked at her based on the comments. Because I know a lot like, of bad people, like bad chicks, but their attitude is messed up. It's fucked up. And that's because they got demons. Yeah. They daddy not in their life. Mm. So something else went down they ain't really tackled with. Yeah. So they waiting on you to validate everything about them. If they don't get what they want, they don't know how to handle it. Right. You right. Know? right. That shit. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Growth is real. It's it not is. just based on your age. age. It's yeah. based on your mentality. Your mentality. It is. You know. So true. So it is. True. Uh, Message. You say that, <laughs> Miss Wilson. Yes. When did you start the the, the Coleman Cellar thing? <sighs> okay. So. Um, I think I was still like was, two, two you fifty. Were rocking, yeah, for real? and I'm just yeah. You was two fifty when you were doing the cold when, 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 when I started. Okay. And so when I started, <laughs> you know, I got this. I was like, I need to, you know, I was dealing with somebody, and yeah. you know, they wasn't coming home. So I thought I need to find me a workout class. So I joined this workout class, and. Uh, I started really liking it, and yeah. then I thought, you know how we are as black people. <laughs> I think I can do that job myself. Yeah. And so one day, yeah. the instructor didn't show up, and I started teaching the class, and then the next thing I know, they was like, you need to do this more often. Yeah. So I just took over. Wow. Your energy yeah. is ridiculous. Well, I seen you have, like, damn near yeah. the whole gymnasium. <laughs> right. Well, like, doing, doing the butterfly. <laughs> I mean, because you do a lot of dance, yes, right? Yes, yeah. yes, yes. You, I seen everybody, like, I said, oh, you got little people, big people, show people. Well, because I need to, I need people, I think young people oh, tap yeah. into looking at us. Yeah. They yeah. look at us. Right. You know, my boys, they think I'm a great mom, but they didn't really respect me until they saw my journey. Mm-hmm. You know, they loved me to death, yeah. but they didn't really respect me until they said, this thing I went back and got three degrees and done right. pulled us out the hood. And yeah. then they really started to understand because, again, it wasn't what I said. Yeah. It was what I did. What you was you doing. Know? Yeah. Yeah, show folks. Yeah. So the yeah. young people, you know, when they see me on stage or they see, like, Wow, she don't even care, right. you know, what people saying to her, and you know, because I get hate emails just like anybody True. else. I get emails to say, you know, I look like a man and stuff like that. But it's I, my it's journey, so my rude. journey. Man. Well, you're but not, that's haters, man. man well, that's terrible. They, I mean, that's just what somebody, they, that's that, being rude is in their DNA. And yeah. somebody who sent you know? an email probably sitting right now, yeah. eating Doritos on the yeah. couch. Right, right. <laughs> but you know, my uncle told me, uh, you ain't made for everybody, right. so don't pretend to be for everybody. Exactly, yeah, right. and that's. That's why I tell people you have to watch what you do on social media because all attention ain't a good attention. Yep. It's okay. That's true. You know, that one person going to yeah. think you is amazing, yeah. you know, and that's what you need to work on. Right. Not trying to be out there for everybody. You are not community property. Right. You know? You and then you wonder why you can't get that job that you yeah. apply for Come and on, probably man. rightfully deserve. Come on. But look at your look at your social though. That is real. Man, you got you pounds sitting on the side. You know what I mean? I, I I I'm real huge on that to for people to just be doing dumb shit. Right. And but they don't get it. It's like when you call them out on it, it's like, like they look at me like I'm hating. I said, no, you I'm incriminating like, you, yourself. Yeah, yeah like right. a dude from Walmart yeah. selling chicken. <laughs> I got it, baby. He's throwing it like it's dope. I got it. I got it. I'm like, man, you better yeah. go to jail. You should go to jail. You know <laughs> what I'm saying? But up. they don't they don't get it though. Yeah. Uh, well, attention and clout seeking is real. Man. You know, these females will strip down in their bathroom and post mm. the picture. Mm-hmm. You know? And that's forever. It's yeah. forever. You know? And, you know? Fold clothes. and then what? <laughs> <laughs> you did all that can't fold clothes. Fold them, baby. <laughs> she can't do it. Now she looking like a Rubik's Cube. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that one, man. <laughs> Yeah. But society has, you know, I yeah. heard it's a fans only page out. Oh, uh, uh, all that's, fans. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's working out here, man. And it, it's it's different categories of the of really? the fans. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. Oh, man. But that's, that's, that's just that's the thing. That's the that's the vanity, that's money. and that's the yeah, and that's the that's the part of it. 
Yeah. You know, people you are You get all the fans' pages. You working out. That's you know it. what I'm saying? It, it right. Is, people right. just follow you. But, yeah. but what is it doing to your legacy, though? That's what know? I'm saying. But see, these girls now, they... It's hot girl summer. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's all the time. But, <laughs> well, but I think it's not just not the young folks. It's folks. I mean, but she, said, but she said it, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of the females is looking at those, you know, paid models uh-huh. that yeah. the Instagram is paying for right. them to pose for these pictures. Right. And that's what they that's what they seeking for. Right. You know what, what I'm saying? Thing, man, what, what validation you want, though? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Okay, she cute. Yeah. Her booty big, yeah. yeah. And that's it. Until her only <laughs> until her only fans page pop up, and right. she's gonna walk down the aisle and exactly. got a good guy on right. her arm, and then you know she bent over. Yeah. Right. Um, you know what I'm saying? It's just like it's 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 yeah. out of control. And yeah. again, they seeking validation yeah. whether they should know they're good enough with they sell. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I work for a top hospital, and the first thing we do when we hire people, we check, check they yeah. yeah yeah. You know yeah. Y'all wonder why you can't get a job. <laughs> Stop incriminating yourself. Make yourself look bad on social. Yeah, yeah my little cousin's going to get a job. I'm just at, saying. Uh, and Mrs. Winters. Yeah. In Chattanooga. Right. Mrs. Winters still open. Yeah, down in Chattanooga. Damn. Damn. Yeah, they need to bring that back. They were about to. They, they they oh, every morning. <laughs> every morning I had to. They was seeing the thing about it. He went through orientation and everything. They yeah. about to learn how to sift the flowers. <laughs> you makes me sick. <laughs> I said, yeah, damn. He cannot get hired sipping flour. I said, damn. He said, yeah, man, I was in the middle of that. I said, well. I had one more course, K. Yeah, yeah. One more course. I said, man, this shit here crazy. Yeah, yeah that's so smitty. We get it. Well, I mean, they placing their money out there, and yeah. it's out of control. It, it is it's really out of control. But again, if we get more stand up guys like you guys, that's oh. putting the word out, you know, making people talk and communicate. Mm-hmm. Dialogue yeah. is everything. It is. When we go to the club, we don't even talk no more. We mm-hmm. don't. If, if she bend over, I'm jumping on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what is going on? Nobody's really. Really, you know, and, talking and, anymore. And, that, and I feel like I, that part, I, people hating on each other too, yeah. in a big way. Like right. I said, with your fitness, you right. you out here rocking them out, throwing them guns up, then yeah. you put your dress on and fitting. Right. You know, they still go hate. Yeah. And it could be your best buddy. And they do school. be my best buddy. Oh, That's sad. Me and Mal talk about it all the time. Yeah. Yeah, well, school. you know, we need to add one more in there. What is that? Family members. <sighs> Hey, y'all don't come to nothing. They be free, free. Suck you mm-hmm. like a vampire. Yeah. It's running around the corner right. next door to our house. Right. Well, I'm going to be over there, but, you know, mm-hmm. little Tony. Mm-hmm. Make, it, make it place before yeah. the blessing. Yeah, you know, it's car running hot. Yeah. So yeah. I well, see, they see, they see, like, okay, let's leave y'all too. Yeah. So, I'm a family member. I see the potential in you. You know what I'm saying? You guys got your little thing going. You putting the you. words out there. Yeah. So, if I'm a hating family member, I'm going to plant some negative seed. Because, see, it's more easy for me to pull you down than to climb up on your ladder. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So that's what they doing right now. I mean, make no mistake, just because you ain't where you at, you still a threat. Your potential is a threat. What this is right here is a threat. Because y'all could be out there shooting dice and taping it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Or you could be out there playing games or or messing around and broadcasting women's in a negative manner, but you're not doing that. And this could potentially be big. So haters tash in on that. They they bring that negative feel so that way their job is to shut you down. Right. Because truth of the matter is, you guys don't even see the bigger picture in it, but they do. I've always liked to, okay, like even before we got, you know, we got this started, like to me, I I don't want to be put out there like I am, you know, doing something that's just totally crazy, like, that's positive, that can come back, you know, and bite you. So I always wanted to do positive stuff right. with yeah. this and not, you know what I'm saying, <clears throat> just because, like you said, we are an example. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, Because I told Mal, I said, yeah. we ain't going to smoke Black and Miles on this show, but we will smoke Black and Miles. We will. <laughs> now, we do. We do. We <laughs> smoke. We, hey, we, yeah, we going to smoke. I know many niggas smoking it. that shit. Yeah. So, yeah. it's illegal. I'm going to smoke my grass. I'm yeah. sorry. You just can't smoke it in here. Yeah. yeah. Make exactly. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? But, but Black and Miles, where you talking? Oh, we will never have a tobacco <laughs> fight. <laughs> At all. Never. Yeah. Like my grandma say, who's smoking that grease? Yeah. 
I know y'all smoking that roof. <laughs> I mean, yeah. that, you know, I've even seen females now. They out smoking dudes. Oh yeah. They said that forty dollars. That forty dollars a real thing. What is the forty dollars? Yeah. Man, you get some. I, <laughs> I just heard stories yeah. Yeah. that you can get a lot out of forty dollars. Yeah, yeah. some good, some reef in the drink. Mm. That's all they want. I mean, I don't mind. I mean, I don't mind the ladies. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I'm that's what I heard. Now some 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 women some women that I've seen that that smoke the bud it, it physically is not doing them mm-hmm. no justice. Yes, yes. But it's some that it don't affect them like mm-hmm, it. So mm-hmm. you know, I don't mind. You know, I don't mind well, like, like, smoking. It, like it's just to get high. Because if I'm if I'm your man, I'm like, look, babe. You know, we want to maybe cut it down. Maybe your blood and maybe you know. Every other oh, day or something. Train. You know what I'm saying? You know, you going through an eighth <laughs> in 48 hours. That's not good. Like, damn, baby. Like, boom. I we had some more weed. I know, like. Nigga, <laughs> check it out. <laughs> you seen my crown roll, baby? Damn, baby. <laughs> but no, nah, I don't mind my, I don't mind my lady smoking. I, I don't. You know what I'm saying? I don't yeah, mind. I don't. I don't either. You know. But not black and mild. No, wow. negative. I'd rather have her Newport with him. Just do like this. <laughs> Get her behind the hill. Nah, I'm with you. You know what I'm saying? Shit, let's, let's smoke, shit. But you get so many people inspiration, yeah. though. Well, yeah. I thank man. you. And, I try. And damn it, I just want to thank you, man, for all of you yeah. done. And, and, you know, do um, you got a... Um, Anything you want to say to the people as far as motivational right. skills, any events nigga, you got like popping, like, like, yeah, you know, like, well, you know, COVID got us limited, but yeah, I'm always yeah. online. You know, okay. you need a workout class. I'm always online doing Zoom. I'm on pretty much a couple of social media sites, Facebook and Instagram. Um, but right now, I'm not gonna lie, I'm selfish. I need to get this PhD. I'm three months away, so yeah. nothing gets me. I seen me. the Sarah Cashy over there. Yeah. Really Listen, like you know, you know we from the hood, and right. for somebody to say, dude, you gonna run your study at Vanderbilt Medical Center. That's crazy. That's yeah. yeah, where we from, too. That's right. crazy. Yes. That's crazy. Yeah. So, you know, I think people need to start manifesting. Yeah. Really, really manifesting. Just, I don't care where you been at and where you going. You just need to understand that there's more power in you manifesting your dream than it is you getting out there trying to find somebody to manifest it for you. Right. Yeah, we right. gotta get as, as, I think we need a group. You know, yeah. that age when, you know, we turn as, you know, yeah. Yeah. you know that teenage age, man, you think you're smelling yourself a little yeah. bit, you think you're right. the world and shit. Yeah. And, and you know, really just somebody just say hey, mentoring you and be like, look, right. If they will listen. It just it's like so this is what hard. It is. It's so hard right now because let's just say the rappers and the social media, they, they got, got them. Yeah. They got them. Mm-hmm. It's hard. Daddy gone. Yeah. Daddy, daddy been gone daddy for been a gone. while. Yeah. Daddy been gone. And you know, that's really not really change. Like, daddy used to be gone from your mama, but now daddy gone. He's for real gone. Yeah. Like, yeah. You catch him on social media. That nigga like him. <laughs> <laughs> that's my daddy. That nigga got black. <laughs> And when you show that nigga, I mean, I mean, I work for JB Hunt and so on. But yeah, but it gone though. Yeah, it's yeah. gone. The yeah. role, you know, and so I can't fix everything, but I can fix my role. I can right. be a better auntie. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can yeah, be a better yeah. sister. You know what I'm saying? I can tell, call my brothers up and say, you yeah. know, dude, I love you. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I know that you, you know, you probably ain't got your driving license yeah. yet, but I love you. <laughs> you know? And you know? The most important thing, too, like, with your with your story, like, you can, you you raising three kings. Mm-hmm. And what, what's their ages? 25, okay. 21, okay. and 19. They, okay, they all grown, but in the in, in the age, but in, not in the mind. But not in the oh, okay. <laughs> well, it takes us a little time. It takes a little time. It takes us a little. Time. So, you know, it, you know, it, it does, and I'm it, very proud of you. Yeah. Take your time. Take but your time. You are most definitely a, a most definitely. If, if there's anybody that tells them that they can't do nothing, that shouldn't even no. be in their mind no. completely no. because no. my mom went from this. Yeah. To this, so yeah. if it's anything that's most important with that, is most definitely they seen they seen that. Right, yeah. you know there's no saying? options when the front door right. closes, you kick in the back. That's exactly. just what we do. Exactly, you know, yeah. and we getting away from that. You know, we yeah. want it laid out to us, but right. we got if anything worth having is worth grinding for. Because it's anything, not gonna come to you. It's not. Yeah, right. and so yeah, you right. just got to. I, yeah. I was telling about it the other day. I said, right. man, all the stories I look, you know, I, I, I do a lot of studying. Yeah, as far as entertainment things, like everybody got a story. It's it's the grind. It's the grind. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And people don't want to grind. People no, don't want to eat them they, sandwiches. And Jay Z, all everybody. of them came. They didn't come overnight. Right. They've been grinding for years. years. Yeah. Yeah. For years. And they got that one break and it came. But that all came with 15, 16 years of hustle. And then, oh, and like you said, when, when opportunity shows, you got to 
got to be ready. You got to be ready. Yeah. And that's the thing that we don't want that no more. You know, yeah, we want to throw a picture up and hopefully it takes off. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know? But it's the, it's the, it's the grind, man. And it's the grind. Yeah, and it's it not, not going to be easy. Right. You know? And it's not going to be handed to you. You're going to get a whole lot of no's before you get there. Yes. Yeah. Man, you know? say that. A yeah. whole lot of haters come with it. They come yeah. with it, yeah. you know? And so you just got to be prepared. You got to have a vision that nobody else can see. Yeah. You know, you yeah. got to feel it. You got to, at night when you close your eyes, it's got to be buried in your mind that this is what I got to do or nothing is worth living for. Exactly. That's just my policy now. And if you got a vision that nobody else can see, also yeah. nobody can take it away from you. Yeah. You know? Yeah. yeah. You're right about that because the people will come and try to take it. They, it's serious. Right. I'm telling you. Because the devil is slick. Right. <laughs> he what? He's slick as a motherfucker. He be over there chilling out the blue. So nobody like, hey, I just came yeah. out the blue. Right. She pretty, man. Nothing yeah. with you. Like, have you all thrown off? Yeah. Thinking about something? But they, and they don't want to have standards. Right. You know, we get distracted from the littlest thing. If it don't fit, oh, Lord, we done. You know? Yeah. I got told no <laughs> all the time. I don't care. Yeah. I mean, and it, it is right now. Everybody knows that takes my class. I don't care. There's a will, I'll make a way. It's just going to have to be this way. Yeah. This is what I was designed to do. Yeah. I'm a hustler, but I'm also a motivator. Mm. I got to get this thing done with or without you. You know, it would be easy if people would help me, yeah. but I I don't care if I walk this alone. Right, right, right. Yeah. You ain't feel like you don't know me. Yeah. I see Wonder Woman on your own. Okay, she's not. Where's her, where's her lasso? <laughs> I know it's somewhere around Okay, there. she, Miss Catherine is not waiting on nobody. Where's that visible plane? <laughs> I know it's out here somewhere. <laughs> She Wonder Woman on your arm. She, yeah, yeah. I said, man, she got that rock. Yeah, because I was, I was yeah, doing you know some research, you know what I'm saying, yeah. all week. And yeah. my son was walking through uh, <laughs> through the through the through the house. Mm -hmm. And I had your picture blown mm -hmm. up. You was you yeah. was like nice. this. He was like, damn, damn, who was like, who was that? It's like, man, her arms look better than yours. <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, I'm like and I was just like, well, oh, damn. I mean, okay, yeah, but this is the, you know the nice lady we interviewing <laughs> today. <laughs> she was like, man, I need to get cut like that. Yeah, <laughs> Nigga, the boat, nigga, he did for the next two weeks. Exactly. But uh, shout but, out to the military guys that trained yeah, me. Shout yeah. out to Memphis for my tattoo. But again, <laughs> that is, yeah, uh, yeah. you know, this it's guys. They told me you want right. better arms, and then they made yeah. me do it. You yeah. know, and if you want something, you go get it. Yeah. It's you know, there's no such thing as wasted time, long right. as you work it for yourself. Right. You know. Right. Because yeah. time is valuable. Like it is valuable, yeah. but when you give it away and you're waiting on something to just to come and instead of going out there, you don't know what happens when you come out there and try to apply yourself. Doors will automatically open yep. just because you're pushing yourself and yep. putting this, yourself in a positive environment. So, yep. shout out to the, all the people that's trying to make a change, you yeah. know? Yeah, man, shout out to y'all, man. We got love for y'all, man. Even during this COVID-19, man, because mm. I know it's heavy for everybody. It is. Right now, because we came in with a Tornado. We the, did. Then, then, then the COVID then came. The COVID. Yep. Then, uh, you know, since, and you know, we ain't done the show since the Black know, Lives Matter. And some of these cats George getting Floyd. good on that employment check. You know that employment yeah. check. Yeah. You they, <laughs> we done heard it. I'm hot. They I, mean, I ain't hot because they still got my benefits. Yeah. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just thankful. Exactly. <laughs> take, my job. take it back. Take it back. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I ain't going to say, oh, they made it. Nah, man. Yeah. 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 You know what I'm saying? He just, you yeah, know. Yeah, but $800 man. a week. I heard about $900. Yeah. Uh, man, I seen the dude at the grocery, not the grocery store, but the convenience store, yeah. grocery shop, and I said, yeah, he must got that stimulus. That's true, yeah, yeah. That nigga getting all the canned goods. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I just hope a lot of them is taking taxes out on that money. Because I just, you know, at the end of the year, that's going to, boy, you think you claiming Tay Tay and you? It, it, it's, it's, 2020 is an hey. ugly year. It's an ugly year. Yeah. Because, you it know, is. They, they went to, with the with the It vote. is. But you know, it could be an ugly year. But you could be, you a whole beast when you yeah. come out of it. Like, mm. three months ago, I went in, yeah. not even, nowhere near close to my PhD. But because the world shut down, yeah. I didn't stop. It made me a better person. Yeah. So I think, like, if you guys, if you're able to maintain your lifestyle and keep being positive... Actually, you a whole beast out yeah, here. Because yeah, if yeah. you a beast when the world is crashing, right. imagine what right. you will. Yeah. And see, you have to keep that type of mindset. See, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. it, it don't have to directly affect you. Right. You just got to stand strong and do what you need to do. Yeah. You know? Oh, uh, yeah, me and Miles, we were like, man, we're going through the COVID. 
Like, yeah. we, about two weeks, and we were like, yeah, we can't do the show. Cause right, we go. right, right. So that's when it was... So we like, hold on, yeah. cut all this shit down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, well, put a lights on. Right. Put, all this put, shit a, put a pause on this thing, and, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, and at the same time, we still yeah. working with People still thing. need encouragement. Mm-hmm. People still need motivation. So if you have to take it to another platform, that's just what it is. Right. The world will gravitate to you instead of you gravitating to the world. There it is. <laughs> Miss yeah, Captain yeah, Wilson. Yeah. Wilson. Yeah. Oh. This is nice, man. This is beautiful, man. Oh, man. This, this is, beautiful. is another Scatter Sites Entertainment production. This is The Cypher with KJ and Miles. Yup. And this is episode 15, The Catherine Wilson Story. Hey, hey, hey. And we here at 557, Sam really at the Ridley's Barber Lounge, man. We like to thank Antoine Ridley, man, for mm-hmm. having us at our, you know, our first spot, man. We like to thank yeah. OG Cosprays, man. man. What up with your fox, man? Go get that sucker repellent, man, please. Uh, yeah, go get it some. We, we got to follow y'all suckers. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, Kathy, man. Thank you. I'm gonna thank you, man. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, tell them when you where yeah, you can shop, find shoot your baby. tags. Where you get your Instagram? Um, I'm on like, Facebook. It's okay. not hard to find me. It's Catherine Tisha Wilson. Um, YouTube for um, the TED Talks. Um, they actually did a TV show called Modern Hero. It's out there. All you have to do is Google Modern Hero. But if you mm-hmm. Google Catherine Tisha Wilson, because I did a pretty good job of marketing myself, all right. it'll automatically pop up. There okay. it is. If 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 anything you can tell anybody about life in general mm-hmm. and you being a beast like you are oh, what, what would you, you tell them um, don't let your past define you mm. you know your past is a part of you it's not a whole component of you you need to take whatever you've been through and utilize it in a matter that motivates, inspires, and promotes you. Mm. You know? Don't be afraid to wake up the next day and change everything. You determine your own success. Right. You know? Stop letting outside influences to d- dictate your future. You are what you claim to be. So, your past, whatever it is, can actually turn it around for you. You just need to put yourself in a position to win. There it is. There it is, man. At this show, man. Well, you got anything to say, man? Oh, man, that's it, man. I can't say no behind that one right hey, man, there. Man, it was a beautiful yeah. Oh, man. You don't want to have me like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, missed it. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah. We, um, we glad to everybody. We'd like to thank the yeah, studio man. ones, man. Just yes, Jeff. DJ Duff on the ones and twos, man. Yes, sir. We like to thank everybody, man. Scatter Sites Entertainment Production, man. Y'all can catch us on scattersites.com. Yep. And uh, shout out to Unpaid Bags. Uh, it ain't easy being sleazy. Yeah, six one fifth. Six one fifth. Right. We out there, man. Grown kid. We love you, girl. That's the first lady of Scatter Sites Entertainment with the music. That's right. And uh, we in it just like this. Peace, love, church. Peace. <laughs>